Volkswagen Golf R Road Test. If you ask the average enthusiast if they'd like a 292 horsepower hot hatch with a manual transmission and all-wheel drive, you'd probably be greeted by a big smile and a variation of hell yes. That's exactly how we feel about the 2015 Volkswagen Golf R. Driven normally on the street, the Golf R is as civil and friendly as any other Golf. In fact, if you don't wind the car well up into the upper middle of the tack, you may not notice any big upgrade from the GDI. But wrap the needle up to 6,500 revolutions per minute or so, it runs out of breath beyond that, though the red line doesn't come in till just over 7,000, and the Golf R wakes up. Change the mode to race, turn off the traction and stability control, and the Golf R more than wakes up, it transforms. Being able to fully turn off the traction and stability controls will be a welcome feature for North American buyers, who were plagued by a not quite fully disengaged set of electronic nannies in the Mark V Golf R now, with the Mark 7, Volkswagen has decided we can decide for ourselves how Larry we wish to be. That's a beautiful thing, as the Golf R does Larry very well. Aiding the German HOD hatches 292 horsepower and 280 pound-feet of torque in the pursuit of performance is a Haldex-based 4-motion all-wheel drive system that can transfer up to 100% of torque to the rear wheels on demand. The result is a Golf R that can scramble to 60 miles per hour in under 5.0 seconds. The Golf R can turn, too, of course. And it turns very well indeed when outfitted with the dynamic chassis control adaptive damping suspension, which firms up body control without compromising daily comfort. With the electro nannies out of the way, the Golf R's chassis demonstrates a very well balanced nature, rotating into and through corners with ease, provided the driver takes into account the rather large chunk of the car's curb weight sitting over the front axle. Electronic differential locks contribute to this neutral rotation willing behavior, using the brakes to help distribute power not just for acceleration, but for managing cornering loads, too, taking away much of the understeer that would otherwise be present. Of course, this all comes at a price. The 2015 Golf R kicks off at $36,595 in its first year form, with the dual clutch DSG gearbox. There is room to upgrade, however, Add the DCC and nav packages and you'll upgrade from 18-inch to 19-inch wheels, gain a navigation system, plus DCC adaptive damping, Fender premium audio, and front and rear park distance controls, for a price of $39,090 with the DSG. If you opt for the manual transmission once it becomes available, you'll save some cash, about $1,100 on each version. Add $820 in delivery fees to the price for on the lot figures. Despite the nearly $40,000 price tag, the Golf R makes a compelling case for itself in a segment where very few cars remain to play. The Subaru WRX and SDI are the main contenders for the all wheel drive, turbocharged, stick shifted enthusiast mobile, and while the WRX at least is considerably less expensive, it's also considerably more utilitarian in its materials, equipment, and looks. The Golf R not only shirks the boy racer aesthetic, it upgrades to more grown-up levels of comfort and feel. But flip the right switches, hit the track, and let the Golf R rip and it will set the tires screaming, and set the driver smiling, shouting their own hell yes.